I might, I might be a little too excited about this, y'all. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know why this makes me emotional. <laughs> yeah, I do. I know why it does. That's what I'm doing. I'm committed now. And I really hope I don't step on the snake. I did it, I did it, I did it! Hey y'all. Well, before we get going with today's video, I want to take a quick moment and give a shout out to a special little boy and his sister, Adam and Mary in North Carolina, that evidently like watching. Adam, Mary, hi. Thank y'all for tuning in and for liking my channel. Your dad told me how much you did and it made my day. So, thank you. I hope you'll keep tuning in. And also, keep an eye out for your mailbox. You might have something coming soon. All right, I hope y'all enjoy this one. The Gleaner is going. Y'all, I hear something. <gasps> I hear something coming in our driveway. Look at there. It's the cleaner. But I still haven't decided what I want to name yet. This is so cool. Maybe he needs eyes. He's gonna put fuel in it. And you know what that means? It means we're gonna take it for a little spin today, I believe. Y'all, I was just thinking, I really think I'm going to have to go with Gertie. Dirty Gertie. Marty and Dirty Gertie. Old Dirty Gertie. Gertie. We'll see. What did you just say? We're, we're changing the oil. This is the hose that the oil comes out of, but on this stuff it's like a plug down under there that you would unscrew. But this is just that something that goes into it and you screw it on and then you unscrew it to let the oil out. Okay. So that, okay, yeah. It's pretty full. Trying to find the oil capacity. Hold on. Okay, this engine crankcase capacity is 11 quarts. When the filter is changed, 12 quarts will be required. Go. 12 quarts. Good. Doing a little math today. Yeah. <laughs> the motor up yonder. Thing about a monkey wrench, it's always tighter on the end than it is in the jaw. Tighter on the end than it is in the jaw. <clears throat> and so I need to turn this one. Yeah. That's a true monkey wrench. No, it's not a pipe wrench. wrench. Oh. <laughs> Just got a lesson on how to put a lid back on an oil container in case you want to pour it. Make sure you put it where you can actually pour it and it's not right here. Like the one he's using is. <laughs> All these little things that you just don't know until you know, right? No, until you learn. Until you learn. And that's when you know after you learn. Make sense? Mm -hmm. <laughs> So we're 
we're definitely not going to get it running today. We've run out of time. Um, but the old's been changed. Blowing it all. Cleaning it up. And we need to put some Freon in it and hope and pray that that works. Yeah. Got to clean this thing out. Try to get the air conditioning working, hopefully. But we had to rig up that tarp, so that this gear didn't get wet. <laughs> this is the never ending project. What do you think, Bonnie? Just chilling, Mom. Just chilling. <laughs> mixed the second gallon of tea for the day. <laughs> it's just been one of those days, y'all. It's too hot. My husband is drinking tea. My husband and my boy have been drinking tea like mad people. This is my starter, which I need to make more because this will be gone tomorrow. If you missed that in one of my videos, I showed how I make tea starter because we go through an inordinate amount of tea. Well, per usual, the best laid plans. So I was hoping to get the gleaner in the field and combine a small section. I still don't know what to call it. <laughs> Shell, combine, pick. Anyway, he's got almost everything done. The air condition's not working even though he was told it was. He got the fan going, but even uh, adding the Freon didn't work. So, he's gonna try to figure that out. Oh, Bonnie, I thought you were in the house. Get in. All right. So now, we are going to pick him up in the field. He's going ahead and taking the dump truck which is going to be our our loading unloading loading and then unloading truck so anyway i think it's the dump truck yeah it's like every day there's something else keeping us from getting going and it's starting to frustrate me i'm sure it's frustrating him more though anyway Hopefully one day this week we will we will get to get to do a trial run. Keep you posted. is a beautiful thing. My son was confused. He told me that he was doing it tomorrow. So I guess he's going to do it without any air conditioning. And, <laughs> and we only have an hour and a half before I have to take Wesley to guitar practice. Some days we just need, I need a clone. I just need a clone. I need more than one of me. And I'm sure you all I feel the same way at times. Do 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 do. Here we go. Oh, that their gleaner. Gertie. I'm just decided I'm gonna call it Gertie. Dirty Gertie. Even though she's cleaner. She's a cleaner gleaner now. <laughs> oh. Go Gertie, go. Funny? No. Nope. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be so hot in there. The air not working. So this is gonna be a short run. We were just planning on doing a short run anyway, just to get a load to to use for cattle feed. And 
let it be a good little test. Look at the wheels, they look wobbly. I know why it does. There's a lot of blood, sweat, and tears in that thing right there. And as hard as my husband works for what we do, what he does, and what we have, it just means a lot. Nope, it's not new. The air's not working. He's hot. He's frustrated. <laughs> but it's going. It's going. It's more than we had. And we're happy to have it. And all this, all this, these thoughts just make my eyes leak. That's why. So we have had corn combine before, but we, we had a neighbor do it who was a dairyman and had corn near us. He rented some land near us. And so we had him come the last several years and combine some for us. He has since gone out of business and that's what kind of spurred Lawrence to look for something that we could afford. And, uh, he knew he wanted a gleaner. He knew what he wanted and he found it. And by golly, he's got it going. Yeah. All right. No doubt this will not be the last of the tears related to that gleaner, I'm sure. <laughs> and I'm sure there's gonna be more tears that are not happy, nostalgic, emotional type tears, but. <laughs> And they, they might come today for all I know. Uh, but here we are. Combining our own corn. With our own combine. For the first time ever. And it's, it feels good. Oh, he's out. He and my boy are inspecting. <laughs> this is just all new to me. The whole combining process, I guess. You know what's left? How much is left? Is that really bad? Is that okay? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We're getting back in though, so maybe that's a good sign. <laughs> They're over there somewhere. I might also be crying because I really wanted to ride. <laughs> there's not enough room and there's no air and uh, whatever. If it's not totally full when he gets around, I'm hopping on there. Nope, you know what I'm doing? I really do want to ride and I really have a feeling that thing's going to fill up. So I'm going to walk across this here cornfield corn stalks are talking and uh I'm gonna try to find them and I'm gonna just hop on the outside that's what I'm doing I'm committed now and I really hope I don't step on a snake or get lost in the cornfield maybe this wasn't a smart idea have you ever just walked through a cornfield like this 
kind of eerie. I know, I know I can't get lost because there's a tree line and I know where the river is. And I'm trying to find, there's this waterway through here that was pretty much cleared out. So I'm trying to stay with that. So it's actually, it's like a little path. But in the path is some weeds and they're prickly. Here we go. Okay. And I know they're still ahead of me. I don't know. He's probably going to get mad at me for doing this. Now, no more waterway. I'm so close, y'all. I can hear him. I'm looking for holes I can go through without messing something up. Ah! It's so close! sitting down there and I did say that and then I said no it's Gurney and Wesley said uh, Alice. What did I say? Okay. Alice it's not Alice I mean I know it has Alice on the side but I'm gonna have to put some duct tape on that and change it uh, all right let's see if we can fix her mm, I should have brought a ladder That sun would feel a lot better if a cloud working on it.
Well, there's no fixing it in the field, so it's gonna drive it home. I mean, hopefully drive it home, that's the plan. And mm -hmm. <laughs> fix it there. No, this is actually not slow motion. It's slow motion. <laughs> But she's going. She's heading home. See how she does getting up this hill. Down it and then up it. If she does that, we'll be we'll be rolling. Yep. Down, down, down she goes. If she makes it up, nobody knows. <laughs> Do you like my songs? Okay, girl. Get up that there hill. Uh, of course, there's a truck coming. It drives. It scares me with that ladder on the side. Mm, kind of scares me being behind her too. I'm not getting any closer. <laughs> Lawrence really liked Old Glory. I wish she had told me that. I didn't know that. We might have to call her Old Glory Gertie. She might have to have first, middle, last name. Old is her first name, really? <laughs> well, I don't know. Back in the shed. Back in the doctor's office. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the girl did good. Yes, she did. She got it done. We got that done low. When it pulled up that done low, to pull the throttle cage back, the throttle cage broke. <laughs> <laughs> but she did good. It looked like a thing in brand new. I turned to blow it down a little bit of a few kind on the ground. I don't think it's blowing none out the back. Now. What kind of receipt break off and fall down before it gets through the head? <clears throat> they get the air conditioning working on, but she'll pick cone, that's the main thing. She'll pick cone. She'll pick some cone. on it's getting dark we just finished supper and now Gus and I <laughs> now we're going to see what's going on I think he's gonna grind that corn that we shelled today is that the right word shelled yeah light there's the light so this will be fun this will be better than having to load all the ears See. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. All right, Gustafer. Still 82 at 7:48. I don't want to get outside, but I'm going to. Okay, you ready, Freddy? You ready, Gus? <laughs> Stay ready, right? <laughs> I'm gonna fold the auger out if I can remember how. <laughs> 